Hi guys, it's Anne Crafty Kimchi. Welcome back to my channel. I am back with a August Chaos Craft release and there is a bunch here that I'm really excited to show you and let's get started on the new dies. So this is um, perfect for summer. Honestly, this is the scooter. It's, it's a Vespa and I really think it's so cute. I can't wait to create something with this. It's giving summer in Italy, Italy and I think it'll be a cute little set. Yeah, I'm excited to play with this. This one is called the uh, Envelope Builder and I'm just going to take this out. So they do come in two sizes, a four inch and a five inch. So basically if you have seen those little tear offs and I haven't played with this before so I'm excited. So I think this would be great for like sequence mixes that you want to kind of like encase into a kind of like a shaker envelope and then you give the option of your pal to tear it off. I think this is so fun and different. I haven't played with something like this before so I think this is going to be a great set to have in your in your stash. Next up is the fall shaker shaker bits and here it comes in four so you have the little mushrooms the rainy boots and this is great for um spring as well the galoshes i think it's perfect this too is can go for spring as well you got the little pumpkin this will be really pretty in a fun little orange color and this is um some squirrels so as a new yorker I approve of the squirrels. <laughs> All you need is the acorns. So this is a fun little set. It's like a DIY sequence mix, basically. Then we have the shaker acorn. So she's created a couple of new dies for fall. And this one comes with a flower set as well. I love this. It's so pretty. Look at all the embossing. And here is the shaker acorn. So you just need the, uh, the little squirrel next to the acorn getting ready for fall. We also have the pumpkin shaker tag. So here's the tag and then here's the layering pumpkin that you can add on top to give it a little fun little pop. And it comes with two sentiments. It says hello fall. Ooh, and then it comes with the layering little green stem for the pumpkin. Love this. So cute. Next up, we have the fall sentiments. And I'm going to do my best to read these because it's kind of hard doing this upside down. And of course, I like to make it a surprise. This says hello fall. This says um, it's so hard to read upside down. Warm, warm hugs, hug, oh, hey pumpkin, oh that's cute, so you got a couple of really cute fall sentiments, I love the layering sentiments, I think it's really just a fun little accent to your projects, next up we have the pumpkin basket mini album, this is so, so cute. Um, I think that says boo and scary. So there is some sentiment to this and candy. Oh, this is so cute. Look at all the little layering pieces on this. And this is for the top. And I'm just going to measure the pumpkin to kind of give you a idea of how big this is. So this is about five and a half by... A little shy five inches so it's a really nice size I kind of really like this a lot and it does give you this as well so you have like the layering spooky face and this is probably for the binding for the mini album if you choose to make it so love that that's so cute Let's see what else we got here I think now we have the Christmas stuff. Yep. So stepping into Christmas, we got marshmallow sentiments. So this looks like it says marshmallow. This says hot chocolate. Um, 
cup of cheer. This looks like it says, oh, I can't read that. Uh, warm hugs. What does this say? Cocoa, cocoa bar, cocoa bar. So a lot of really cute marshmallowy sentiments. I'm really excited for the new Christmas release. Although I'm still crafting for Halloween, but we are getting into the 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 feels. Um, this one is the new uh, gingerbread bow, which is so cute. So you got a little baby and a, a mama, and the the gingerbread. Even if you just made an embellishment, is about two and a half inches for the big one. And the small one, the small gingy is two inches. So you got all of the layering pieces. You got the bow. You got the little squiggles for the um, accent. You got the face, which I think is so cute. And, and the best part of it is a bow. It's a double bow. So you could do a lot with this. Make it an embellishment or just make a gingy, which is super fun. And I'm still contemplating probably which Christmas collection I'm gonna craft with this season. We have the Christmas poinsettias, really pretty. It'll be fun to do some layering. We'll find little sets and then next up, we have the boy and girl penguin. I'm just gonna take this out. So here is the penguin. So I'm assuming this is the girls because there's eyelashes on this. And this is the boy. It comes with a scarf as well. You got the little feet, the layering pieces, the eyes. Super cute. Ooh, and then we got the Christmas garlands. Oh, and you get the layering pieces so you can kind of do like an offsetting if you wanted to. I love that. So you can cut this in like a, a brownish cardstock and then layer up the hearts. So cute. Oh, and you can make this a candy cane heart. Love. So, so cute. Next up, we have the three tier tray, the Christmas add on. So I don't have the three tier tray, but I love, love, love these for um, adding little embellishments. So you got the little reindeers, you got the reindeer faces, the Christmas tree, the little sleighs, snowflakes, you got little gingy fams here, um, the swirls for the candy, oh, two options, the little mini points out of, oh my God, this is so good, so cute. And then even like the layering pieces for the stockings. I love this. I honestly, this is probably one of my favorites because it's so mini and it's so easy to add on to embellishments. Um, I think it's really hard to find just little itty bitties to just kind of like bring out just a little accent piece into your embellishment. So even if you don't have their tear tray die, great addition. This is the new Christmas flags and this is obviously an add on to um, the one that came out previously, you got fa la 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 la. This says cocoa, hot cocoa. This says sleigh, vibes, Santa. So that'll be a nice little set to add. We also got the holly berry set. And I love this. Again, super pretty. I love the veins in this. It would be really nice to make some Christmas florals. This one is the Christmas tree album. I'm just gonna open it. Ooh, it's a nice set. So you have like really nice, pretty scallops. Oh, can you just layer them on top? That's pretty, the layering star. And just for measurement sakes, this is about six and a quarter tall by four and a quarter wide. This part is four and a quarter, so. Nice little size, nice little layering. And I love the um, stitch, de stitch details on this Christmas tree. So that'll be fun to create with. And then let's see. 
We also have the Gingerbread Man mini album. And there is a lot in here. Oh my God, it's so fun. So let me just show you the Gingy. Oh, it's, it's kind of reminding, oh, what's that Gingerbread and Shrek? Um, like kind of like a naughty little gingerbread. So you do get some sentiments in here that says recipe. And you even get like the layering little candy pieces. You got like the squigglies, the eyes, the mouth, if you wanted to change his face. Um, I think this is his baker's hat. Yeah, that kind of looks like his hat. You got the rolling pin. And then you've got the tray, which is so cute. I think that is the apron. You got the whisk. This is gr a great little baking set. And you have options for the faces. So if you wanted to make him like super, oh, a girl, because she comes with eyelashes. You can have a gingy girl. Yeah, if you wanted him just to be just smiley. You got this little face here. So cute, I love this set. It's gonna be so fun to create. I think I might go card option because um, I can never have enough cards, you guys. And then last but not least, this is the Christmas train. And when I saw Hannah's video, I was just like, whoa. It is so cool what she did with this. She made a 3D train. And it does come with a lot of pieces, but honestly, if you want to get to that level of detail, you need all of these yummies. This is probably just to create like just fun um, add-ons to the train. But whoa, look at this. You get so much. You got banners. You got little um, layered Christmas presents. Yes, I love that. Got bows, layered candy canes. Like what a great set for embellishments. And you get the train on top of this. It's such a great little treat and perfect to get this Christmas jump started. And that is it for all of the new August Chaos Craft releases. I will leave links to the product information down below. And I, I'm not sure what you're most excited about. Um, I, I don't know, there's a lot of great stuff here, you guys. Like, I think I'm gonna start off with the fall and work my way into the Christmas stuff. But the Gingy mini album is really fun. And I'm excited to play with it. And that is it, you guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.